if you have some USB remotes lying around and you want to use them on your Windows PC. After you plug them in, if you want to test out if the remote's working, you can go to this website called hardwaretester.com slash gamepad. And right now I have a Xbox 360 remote. That's It's a wireless remote that's connected through the a wire. But right now it's showing this message, connect your gamepad and press buttons. So it's not able to install correctly. I need some additional software. But I have this wired uh, generic Xbox 360 remote. You see it's wired, there's no wireless option on it. Now when I plug it into my Windows 11 computer, it does its thing and if it installs correctly, now when I press the buttons, you can see if I press the button, it registers on there, on the screen over there. Sorry. So it shows you the remote, shows you the remote, and gosh, I'm just having a hard time. Sorry, uh, shows you the remote and the buttons, and so when you press the button, see how I'm pressing the bo bottom uh, green button over here? It highlights that button, so it's kind of nice. Uh, and so if you want to test your uh controller, USB controller, uh, or gamepad on your PC, you can just go to hardwaretester.com slash gamepad. There's other websites, but this one seems pretty good because it shows you the uh, a gamepad if it can find one. So let me just unplug this, and I'll show you another example of how, like, natively a PS3 DualShock remote gamepad won't work. So I'm going to plug this into my Windows 11 machine right now. And you'll see, makes a noise like it's installing something. Uh, let me scroll up. So it does show the product, but when I try pressing the buttons over here, nothing happens. So you can see it detected the, uh, the joystick, but none of the buttons do anything. So uh, additional uh, software and drivers need to be installed. Um, for those of you who are curious, there's some software out there that emulates or allows you to use uh, PS3, PS, uh, PlayStation remotes, like this is a dual sh DS4 Windows. I haven't tried this one yet. I have tried a SCP toolkit for my uh, DualShock 3 remote, and it worked fine. And so you have a few options available to yourself. I think this one is pretty popular. And uh, this one I just found out about. So anyways, uh, I'll show you one last time. I'm going to go hook up uh, this generic USB remote. Let's see what happens. So it'll show you it's connect your gamepad, press button to continue. I'm trying to plug this in. Plugged it in. And so, you know it's working if when you press the buttons, it registers on the screen. You can see, I press this button button and this thing, this B2 changes. So anyways, hopefully this kind of helps you. I'm, I'm pretty sure people are smarter than me. But anyways, um, yeah, I, 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 I read online about how you can go to websites to check if your gamepad, joystick, controller is working. And so, I, I just, this is one of the first Google searches, so hardwaretester.com slash gamepad. Just plug in your remote gamepad controller and see if it registers any of the buttons. And that's it. And I'm testing this on the Windows 11 machine.